Hi, everybody. Welcome to Toronto, the home of Wendell, Dougie, Matt, Sittler. So much history. What a great atmosphere here tonight. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. The Bolts will start with the puck as they win the opening faceoff here. Looking to set up offensively. Takes a shot. Oh, a spectacular save right there. Wow. Unbelievable. I mean, it was all but in. And... Oh, what a save. He stopped it. Wow. Oh, that's an intangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. And Cheryl, listen to these fans here. They are getting loud. Some of them are getting on their feet here still applauding that save we saw. James, I think it's the appreciation for the desperation save to compete the will to keep that puck out of the net. And they're really showing him the love. Steps inside the line. Takes the puck at the point. Toronto's got the puck in the corner. Oh, he's got to be sour on that as the equipment malfunction on the play. Well, I'd say how frustrating is that one when you're in key critical spot and then the whip on it and the whip happens because it snaps in half. Matthews gets back to the action right away after getting a new stick after his stick just explodes. The bolt's looking against the half wall. Oh, he's going to get cold on that slash. Samsonov's really impressed me tonight, James. Just look at that last sequence and that desperation save. Unbelievable. I mean, when it's required to be calm and poised, he's got quiet feet. But when he needs to move and make a desperation play, he does it. Stamkos is going to get some time in the box for slashing. get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. Well, a dangerous time tied game and their top rated power play comes out. They have puck possession skills, precision passing, and execution. Denies them on the play. Yarncroke's been a workhorse tonight, James, and there's just another example of it, and the entire bench knows that they're invigorated by it. I mean, he's on his way down, he's stumbling, and he's manages to find the puck and get a shot on net. That's tenacity at its best. Tries to feed it over to Mott. And he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the paddle. Can they capitalize on this power play? Here comes the faceoff. Nylander's quick stick off the draw wins possession. Toronto's across the blue line. Here's a chance! That's gloved by Vasilevsky. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Hedman's got a great defensive game, guys. A big part of that is his stick-em-up zone ability, which is his proficient stick checking in his own zone. He's known to be a responsible player, and you know his coaches put a lot of trust in him because of it. Denied by Vasilevsky! Passes the puck over to Paul. The Lightning have possession along the boards. Moves it to SMO. Sends a pass over. The Leafs take it across the blue line. And skilled use of the stick to put the puck away. Let's the wrister go. Oh, and he lays out to block it. What a warrior. Sends it over to SMO. And it's a quick pass to Perbix. The Bolts take it along the wing. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Here's a shot, and that caroms off a body in traffic. Puck clears the zone, and he maintains possession of the puck here. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. The Leafs are in transition. Quick pass to Domi. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Matthews plays with so much confidence, guys. He can deke his way to the net, then finish the play with a quick shot before anybody can figure out what's even happening. That's his shock and awe zone ability. Tampa Bay's got a hold of the puck. Mott's got it in the defensive end. Takes the feed. 
Tampa Bay's got the puck against the half wall. Tremendous blocker stopped by Samsonov. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Takes it and looks ahead. Stamkos is out of the sin bin. Both sides back to even strength. Well, the PK does a great job. And when you kill a penalty, you create momentum. Great start there. Kucherov's known for making clean, crisp passes. His tape-to-tape -tape zone ability means he can set up his teammates with ease. Matthews can deke his way to the net and launch a quick shot before anyone can react. That's his shock and awe zone ability. One of these players is going to help give their team the upper hand tonight. Guys, back to you. The Leafs have it from their own end. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Takes it to the front. Puts it wide of the net. Uh, and you can see the frustration. You're not going to get a better look than that, James. The goaltender was aggressive. Challenges. And he just misses it wide. The Bolts have the puck in the corner. And it goes off a stick and off to the side. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by point. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Lots of time left in this period. We're still scoreless. The Bolts win the draw here in their own end. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Poked away by Brody. Cuts to the paint. No room for that one to get through. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. And off the draw, they win possession. And here's a pass to Bertuzzi. The Leafs carry it along the wall. Moves with the puck in the corner. Jostling for the puck, and he loses control. Vasilevsky's going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Nice job tying up his opponent. Oh, denied on the play! Wow! Oh, that's a true competitor's save. Just when you think that he's completely out of it, James, he comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive. The Leafs grab possession to the puck. Scrum along the boards. The Lightning have gained possession off the wall. Pokes it away in his own end. The Bolts gain control of the puck. And that pass goes off a stick. Oh, textbook poke check to turn that over. The Leafs play it along the boards. And that's just out of reach. Puck said down the ice, we'll get an icing. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Still no score in this one. Toronto's taking possession in their own end. You hate it when you ice the puck and it comes 200 feet back to your zone. You gotta give your center a tap on the pads after you win that one and get out. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Handles the pass at center. Moves it quickly over to Yarncro. Makes the save. Feeds the puck to Paul. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Pass back to the point, and makes the save. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Centers are lined up, and we are ready to resume. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, what a save on the play! Wow! Oh, that's grand larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save. 
Play continues here, but this crowd's still buzzing after what we saw. What a stop that was. Oh, uh, yeah, and they're saying thank you to the goaltender right now, James. They're still on their feet. They're electric right now. And really, it's a nice feeling. Why? Because it doesn't always go this way. So when you have it, you embrace it. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Scooped up along the wall by Hedman. And now it's over to Kucherov. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Can't maintain possession after that hit. The Lightning have gained control of the puck along the wall. Here's a short pass to point. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Slick feed. Smart defensive play there. Quick feed to Matthews. The scores! Well, talk about a friendly ping right there. Oh, uh, yeah, it's all about the bounces, isn't it, James? And you got to get the right one, and that one is in his favor. I'd like to call this a quiet shot, James. What that means is the goaltender can't see it. So he's listening for it, and it buzzes right by him because he cannot catch up to it, can't find it with his eyes, and can't find it with his body. The Leafs are first to light the lamp tonight, and let's see where it goes from here. There's been some back-and-forth action, and you have to believe that sometimes when there's one, there's more to come. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Shot! to dangle and the puck skips away. Well, he's showing off his skill set, trying to make a silky move around the defender, but he gets denied. Battle ensues for that loose puck along the boards. That's some smart heads-up defensive play by DeHaan. Oh, he saved it! What a stop! Well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. Well, they haven't scored on the power play yet, man. It is a tough thing to do, and this is an earned opportunity. They've practiced. They know what they're doing. It'll come. The Colts have it now. Gets it out of his own end. The Leafs have it against the wall. Toronto's got a hold of the puck. Across the line. Feeds the puck over. Takes a shot. Tampa Bay's got the puck shorthanded. And they get the puck out. Can't keep a hold of it. Dishes it to Lilgren. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Great poke by Lilgren. Taken along the wall by Glenn Denning. Trying to clear the puck from his own end. End up along the boards. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Passes it in front. And that caroms off a twig in front of the net. Slides it diagonally to Yarncroke. Off his stick. And that goes off a player. On the heels of their blades trying to get it out. And they get it out. Toronto's looking to break out of their own end. Quick pass across to Domi. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. The Leafs gain possession. Jomi's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. Moves it to Tavares. Oh, and he makes a save. Just got enough to keep it out. You're trailing by one, and you take the penalty. Not the way to get back in the game. It's a five-on-three man advantage here. Oh, the five-on-three opportunity. Sometimes you can move the puck around the perimeter looking for the perfect play. You gotta shoot the puck. The Bolts have possession shorthanded. Grabs control of it at the point. Matthews put his team in front. Oh, what a save of the play! Whoa! He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. They're really clicking here in the offensive end. All sorts of pressure. Puck moved over to Bertuzzi. 
Quick pass to Marner. Shot! And that doesn't reach the net. Grabbed along the board by Melander. Perfects is back out onto the ice, and they will continue to play shorthanded here. Scores! And they capitalize with the extra player on the ice, and it's a power play goal. Well, using the advantage of having extra ice available to them, James, that's why their most skilled players are on the ice. That one's executed to perfection. Coaches are always harping on pass execution. Well, this is a clear example. When the pass is crisp and it's on the tape, it's on the money, it finds the back of the net. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The Leafs have all the momentum right now, leading by two. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. I don't think anybody was hanging onto the puck after that hit. Tampa Bay's gained possession along the boards. Toronto's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Takes it across the blue line. Pumped off the puck. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. Great pass from off the right side. On the attack along the boards. Snaps it onto the net. Blocked in traffic. He grabs the puck here at the point. And now it's grabbed. Big time save! Oh my goodness! Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. The Leafs get a hold of the puck in their own end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Taken by Hedman. Inside the defensive zone, moving the puck. The Bolts will play it in their own end. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Shot! Takes a shot! Oh, what a glove save there! He read that perfectly! The Leafs continue to lead midway through the first. They have really put on an offensive clinic so far. The Bolts win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Jomi's stick handling in his own zone. The Leafs take it along the wall. Comes up with a stop. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. More than half the period has expired. Toronto's got a 2-0 lead. Domi's won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Great heads-up play with the stick by Hagel. Feeds it on over to DeHaan. The Bolts played along the boards. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Kucherov. Oh, and it stays out as he gets a piece of that one. Samsonov's made a great save, and even better is the redirect to the corner. Takes a wrist shot. Oh, he saved it. Oh, my goodness, what a stop. Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at its finest. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Slides the puck across to DeHaan. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Shot. Oh, scores! All over the rebound and tucks it in for the goal. This is actually a tougher play than it looks, James. You have to have timing and an awareness to be able to get your stick on that rebound and then bury it. Not a lot of time and space available, but he executes perfectly. The Lightning have picked themselves up off the canvas and jumped back into this one. Well, James, it wasn't pretty to start the game, but they found a way to claw their way back in, and they've got themselves within one. Bank pass feed. Cuts to the front. Turned aside with the glove. Covers it up, and we'll get a stoppage in play. The Leafs have had way more chances offensively, and as a result, they're leading in this one. Paul's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Now he takes it over the line. Here's a short pass to Paul. Denies him! Samsonov's aggressive and at the top of his crease and makes an outstanding save from the slot. 
Takes that pass back at the point. Oh, what a save in front. Scrum ensues along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Shiri. Poked away in the neutral zone by Lilgren. Toronto's got the puck against the boards. Stopped by the goaltender. Gains control of the puck here at the line. Rips it, and the traffic neutralizes that threat. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. With the stop. They're like a swarm of bees out here with this pressure. There's a collision. And the D comes up with it. And they'll skate it out of the zone. The bolts played along the wing. And that one's denied. That's not a header in soccer, but is a shot off the mask. Either way, it's a save. The Bolts gain control of the puck against the wall. Quick feed to Shiri. Hard blast. It's in. He scores. Two quick goals in a minute 30, James. Incredible. And look at this. We've got a brand new game now. Well, uh, come to the lead. It goes by the wayside. Giddy up. Oh, James, let's have a look at this goal again. I mean, it's just a desperation play as he's stumbling and just stays on his feet long enough to be able to get his stick on that puck and make a glorious pass so a player is able to finish it. Listen, you got to out-battle, you got to out-will, and that's just pure strength to be able to stay on your feet. Here in the back half of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Glenn Denning's quick stick lands on the puck here at center. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Glenn Dennings crossed the line and is on the attack now. Great reach with the poke check by Riley. They fight for it along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Riley. And that's picked off. Moves into the slot. Slides it across to Matthews. With some open space here in the neutral zone. Puck scooped up by Matthews. The Bolts scoop it up along the boards. Angles it over to SMO. Looking to make something happen at center. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Moves it to McCabe. The Lightning have the puck in their own end. Tampa Bay's got the puck. Slides the puck to SMO. With possession along the wall. Dropper save! And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. See if we can pick up some momentum again here as a faceoff is ready to go. The Leafs win the defensive zone faceoff. Through center. Nylander's into the offensive zone now on the attack. Great pressure with the stick. The Lightning have the puck against the boards. Herbix is taking it from his own end. And that's snapped away in the defensive end by McCabe. Toronto's got the puck. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Pad save. He's on it tonight. Passes it to Hagel. Moves the puck to Perbix. From center, they get into the attacking area. Here's a shot. Here's a shot. And there's a club save on the play. Here in the late going of the frame, we are all tied up in this one. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. Works it across to Reeves. They put the puck into the offensive end. Tries to feed it over to Kucherov. Tampa Bay's gained the line and into the zone. Great poke check on the reach. Toronto's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Circles back to center ice. Puck picked up by Kucherov. Quick pass to Hagel. Can't connect as it goes off a stick. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. 
Moves it quickly over to Reeves. Backtracks with possession back inside the defensive zone. Pokes the puck away. And now it's grabbed by Point. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Puck ready to drop here any moment to get things underway again. Tavares is quick on the draw. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Mott's across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Locks it down in front. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. The Bolts win the faceoff. Jostles the puck loose. Oh, what a stick save! Goaltenders spend so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. Stop by the goaltender. Well, the shooter's in a coveted spot on the ice, right in the middle of it, with a good look, and he makes an incredible save by getting square to the puck and turning it aside. Late goings of this period. It's all tied up. Tavares has won the draw, they'll go on the attack. And he blocks a shot, great defensive play. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Toronto's got control of it now from their own end. Here they come. Quick shot, turns that one away. Slides it diagonally to Mott. Along the half wall with the puck. Fires it on net. Picked up along the boards by Barre Boulay. And he takes a shot. That's blocked. Comes up with the stop as he got a piece of the blocker on it. My goodness, the pressure really building here in the offensive end. And they finally break out, stopping the pressure. Here's a short pass to Shiri. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. The Leafs move it ahead. With the bank pass. That's how you get north in a hurry. Fantastic stretch pass. Oh, how did he get a piece of that to make the save? Right up Main Street and on the attack. Uses the force on that hit. And that's turned aside with the blocker. Well, this is a really great save, James. I mean, you can see that he's battling for position. You can see him moving up and down as his eyes are trying to track and find the puck. That's outworking your opponent and finding a way to make the save. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Carries it in. Quick feed to Matthews. Toronto's got it along the wall. Moves it to Marner. Shuts him down. The Bolts gain control of the puck. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Toronto's got the puck now. Handles the pass. And that's poked away. Taken along the wall by DeHaan. Quick pass to Radish. Pass across to Sorelli. He carries the puck up along the wing. Puts it on net. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. The Leafs move the puck in the defensive zone. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Winding down the final minute of this opening frame. Back at the point, they set it up. And he loses control here. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Takes the pass. And he makes the save. And that's knocked away by Kent. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. Herbix has got control of it now behind the cage. Moves the puck over to Kucherov. Here's a short pass to Point. And a nice takeaway in the defensive end by Reed. Fires it into the offensive zone. Tampa Bay's got the puck in the defensive end. 
Moves it to Hagel. Steps inside. Fires it. The easy glove save by Samsonov. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Officials are set. Players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing back underway. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Quick pass, PR Pro. That'll do it for period number one. We'll drop the puck on the second period in just moments. Just a reminder to always keep your eye on the puck. It can enter the seating area and cause serious injury. And the official seems about ready to drop the puck on period number two. Been a fun one so far. Neither side giving an inch. Still tied here as we open things up in the second. Well, we've seen a pretty good sample size already played thus far. Cheryl, your assessment. The bullets have had zero offensive production in this game. They've been on their heels, and really their opponent is taking it to them. The goaltender has been strong, and it's a reason this game is still tied. Tampa Bay's on the attack. Looks to set up at the point now. With some open space at center. Centering feed, and that goes off a stick. We got a delayed penalty coming up. That trip right in front of the official's eyes. Can't get away with that. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. Kucherov's off to the box. Two minutes for tripping. once again send out their power play unit. Having success earlier on the power play, they recognize where the openings have been. But what I love about it is they're not afraid to change it up. The motion on this power play in these sequences have really been the reason they've been successful. He was totally locked in on that play. Toronto's got possession of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Lilgren. Here's a shot. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. They are really buzzing here in the offensive end. They've got it in the corner. Another shot. Oh, what another big time clutch stop. Skating with it. Shot. There's a save. And there's a whistle as the goaltender will hang on for a much needed stoppage. I always say to be great, you have to get uncomfortable as we look at this last save. This looks uncomfortable. Stretching your body, finding a way to make yourself as big as possible to get to the save. That's what he did, and that's why the save was made. Set to continue this power play here in the offensive end. Well, they need to be opportunistic with the power play advantage here, James, but also because the goaltender is extremely fatigued. You can see the wear and tear on him right now. Puck grab by Lindgren. Oh, and serves up a little too sweet with that save. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. Sorelli's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Steps in and takes the puck. Here's an opportunity to clear the zone. Offside the call, we'll get a faceoff coming up. Nylander's at the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. They take possession as he locks him up off the face-off. A chance to get it out of the defensive zone. And the puck is cleared. Well, you can see the entire PK unit. Their heads are on a swivel, straight line skating, and they're able to get that puck. And because they're looking and aware, they're able to find the white ice and get it 200 feet down. Quick feed to Nylander. Oh, James, when you're in the funnel, you've got that great scoring chance. you got to execute. You can't miss from that area. And play rolls on as he came up with a nice stop there. And they get that puck down the ice. Fine change, Harry. The Leafs get a hold of the puck along the boards. Through center along the wing. Looking to make something happen along the boards. There's the whistle as the puck goes up and over the glass. 
Gretzky's a competitor who never gives up on a play, guys. His contortionist zone ability is what he makes those athletic all-out stops to keep the puck from going in his net. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. Grabbed along the board by Glendening. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And the puck clears the zone. That's why you want players with active sticks on your PK, James. They can close quickly and they can corral the puck and just fire it down the ice. Moves it to Matthews. Denies him. He got all of it. Hammers it on net. Denies him again. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. They're coming in waves. And as both teams are now back at even strength, the power play goes 0 for on the opportunity. That's a great job by this PK unit, James, creating some momentum for their team and getting out of it without getting scored on. And this is critical, given that it's a tie game. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Tavares is caught for the trip, and he's going on a trip to the penalty box. Chance of the night here on the man advantage. Well, first power play of the game, James. You want to start with possession and look to get shots to the net. It is the tone setter. Paul's won the face off, and now let's see what they can do. Protects the puck around all sorts of danger. Moves it to the middle. He scores! What an opportunity and delivers! Well, he certainly looks frustrated after letting that goal in, James. It's almost like a fielder in baseball. If you touch it, you should be able to stop it. And then he gets a big chunk of that one. Unfortunately, it goes in the netting. The Lightning have jumped in front by one here in the second. And let's just see if now they take a breath, James, and the game opens up a little bit. Often when you get the lead, all of a sudden you start to be a little bit more creative. Trust yourself because you're playing a little more confident. He's going to be looking for the Hattie because he's been all around the paint tonight, James, just showing off his skill set. I love the confidence he had to take this shot, James, but it's because his head was up. He recognized he had the lane through the traffic jam and beat the goaltender. The Lightning have put themselves in the driver's seat, now extending their lead to two in the second. Well, they're certainly deserving of their position in this game now, James. They got the go-ahead goal, and then they got that buffer goal. I mean, just to give them a little bit of wiggle room, they can take a breath, and now they can be a little more creative with the puck. Here they come, down the right side and on the attack. Centering feed, and that's intercepted. The Bolts take the puck through the neutral zone. The Leafs take it along the wall. Quick pass across to Riley. Quick. Oh, stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. I really want to look at this last save again, James, because this is about taking it to the next level. When you have this level of competitiveness, athleticism, and desperation and urgency in your game, you know that goaltending coaches, they can't just teach this. This is instinctual, and this is what winners are made of. Toronto's had the scoring opportunities. They just haven't been able to capitalize as they continue to trail. Domi's won the draw there on the attack. And that one stopped. Vasilevsky's been really sharp tonight, James. And then just have a look at his save percentage. And he's making the stops that he needs to. But man, his team's played well. They've got going north. They've created opportunities. And a reason why they have a healthy lead. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Tampa Bay's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Quick pass to Lilgren. The lane was plugged up, and that shot's blocked. Nice zone entry from the middle. Taken by Stamkos. Good, solid check, and he loses control of it. Moves the puck across to Nylander. Loses his balance on the play. Angles it over to Paul. Takes a shot. Denied by the goaltender. 
And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Points, close quarters, zone ability means he's more accurate when he's in tight to the blue paint. Guys, defenders don't want to let him in close to their net. Jomi's won the draw inside his own end. Slides the pass over to Nylander. Kucherov's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. Toronto's got a hold of the puck now. And he was ready for that save. Let's it fly. Oh, he made the save. How did he stop it? I have no idea, James. I mean, he was down and out, but profound athleticism and desperation got him back in to make it. You always have those players who keep the... He scores! Oh, wow, that's how you do it! Well, he's in close quarters, James. That's what he's known for. He gets that puck on his stick, his head is up, and he buries it in the back of the net. Ah, oh, man, James, he is just lethal when he is in the paint. He knows how to shield and maneuver his body to be able to get pucks off quickly. It's what he does best, and he buries one there. The Bolts are having one of those nights, Cheryl, that everything that could go right... Yes. Yeah, it's all going right, James, because they're doing everything right. They've been dominating play in all three zones, and they've been rewarded for it. Great stick work with the steal. Tampa Bay's got the puck against the boards. And he shuts the door on that. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Bolts just recently adding to their lead. They're now up by three. Camps won a big draw on their own end. Sends the pass down low. Works it across to Purvix. Tries to get it to Reeves. Slides the puck over. Reaches out and uses the stick. Tampa Bay's moving the puck through center ice. Goes right to the crease. Scores! They can't. Goaltender on that one picks up the rebound and buries it home. Goalie looks frustrated now. James knows that you got to redirect that puck to a safe spot. Tampa Bay's had that magic touch tonight, Cheryl. Sometimes when you get up in the game, James, it's easy to get complacent and just hold the puck, stop attacking. But not tonight. They're not. The entire bench, the lineup, such an offensive threat. Line one, right through line four. They've been a wave tonight. Tries to feed it over to Reeves. Handles the puck. Poked away in the neutral zone. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Intercepted. Right through center and into the offensive zone. Good use of the body to knock him off the puck. Tampa Bay's looking to break out. Slides the puck ahead to SMO. Good read with the stick to break that up. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Great use of the stick at center by Asimov. Here's a short pass to Yarncroft. And that's intercepted by Paul. Tampa Bay's had a tremendous game so far, James. They've owned puck possession. They've been dominant in the offensive zone. And they're not afraid to attack the net. It's a lot of fun when you can play this way. Picked up along the wall by Shiri. Puts it on that. Gets a glove on it. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Toronto's had a lot of good looks on net, but they continue to trail here in the second. And they win the draw on their own end. The Leafs have it against the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Excellent stick work on the play. Stamkos plays it now. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Chance in front. Oh, what a stop by Vasilevsky. As a goaltender, you have to be able to read and anticipate the play. He does it perfectly and is able to negate the shot. Puts it in deep. The Lightning have possession along the boards. Now a quick pass to point. Oh, and the puck clears the zone. They'll be forced to do this one over. 
scooped up along the wall by Bertuzzi. Poked away at center by Brody. From the point, looks to make something happen. Oh, and it stays out as it goes off the shaft of the stick on that one. The goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. A great core strength to him out of the puck after that. The Bolts looking against the half wall. Here's a chance. Comes up with the stop. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Toronto's taken possession in their own end. Now he slides it up to Marner. Knocked away by Hedman. Into the offensive zone. Here's a shot. Oh, he just got enough of that to keep it out. And he can't hang on after that hit. Takes it into the slot. Jones has it and freezes the play. Toronto's got to find a way to break on through. They've had plenty of shots on net, and yet they trail here in period number two. Glenn Denning's got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. Benoit's got it in the defensive end. Moves it around along the half wall. Tampa Bay's got it in their own zone. Looking to set up offensively. And he's knocked off the puck there. Slides it diagonally to Kent. Shot! Turned aside with the glove by Vasilevsky. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. The Leafs will go to work here in the offensive zone. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Here's a blast! Oh, what a save on the play! Oh, that's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about competing, finding a way to get to the puck. Scores! Pop and bottles for Selly! What a shot! That's just adding insult to injury, isn't it? James, a top cheddar shot that just sends the water bottle assailing. The Leafs finally get some momentum going their way. Now, can they sustain it, though? It's going to be tough, James, unless they can string some shifts back-to-back -to -back together where they do create momentum and have possession in this game. You have to look for ways to be first to the puck, be relentless on it. That's what changes energy. Puck scooped up by Sorelli. Nice speed of center moves up ahead now. Sorelli's team is flying out there, James. I mean, this is a blowout. He already has one. How many more is he going to get? Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Keeps possession. Feeds it up ahead. Takes a shot. Oh, and he gets a piece of that one to keep it out. Enters the offensive zone from the left. The Leafs look to start the transition game. Riley's got it along the wing. And that goes off a player in front. Fires one on goal. Denied by the goaltender. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Tavares is the captain of this roster, James, and everyone is looking to him. That's why he wears the C, and he's got to rally his team and find a way to get back into this game. And that shot dies in traffic. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. Toronto's got the puck. From one point man to another. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Vasilevsky. Look at this attack here in the O-zone. And they'll skate it out of the zone. Gets the puck in deep. The Leafs scoop it up along the boards. And he takes the dish. Moves it quickly over to Tavares. Shot. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. 
takes a shot. Gets a piece of it with the glove. Loves the puck into the offense's own corner. the second of the game. Too bad you can't bottle these games up and just recall them whenever you want because he's been all around the net. They use their speed on this counter attack and gave themselves an odd man advantage here, James. And what they did was they capitalized. They had multiple looks. They could pass it. They could shoot it. Goaltender couldn't figure it out. And it winds up in the back of the net. The Lightning have looked as dominant offensively that I've seen all year, Cheryl. Yeah, and they're having a ton of fun out there. It's easy to have fun when the puck's on your stick and you're executing. Just got to let it ride and keep it going. Quick feed to Kucherov. And he's ridden off the puck. Nylander's moving it ahead. Moves it to Kucherov. Sends it over to point. Hugs the boards through the neutral zone. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Quick pass across to Matthews. The Leafs pick up steam and are on the attack. Toronto's playing it from the side. Shot, and there's the save. Quick pass to Hagel. Gaining momentum up along the side. The Leafs pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. From the point, they take control of it. Here's a shot. And it's stopped by the glove. Nice play there. Well, that's an unbelievable save. A great A scoring chance taken away as he flashes the leather and makes the stop. Toronto's been the busier team offensively with way more shots on goal, but they still trail in the second. The Leafs take possession here inside the offensive zone. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Puck picked up by Radish. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. And now he angles it across to Brody. Toronto's gonna play it from the corner. Picked up along the boards by Barre Poulet. Glenn Denning swooping in on the attack. Here's a short pass to Hedman. Turned aside with a glove by Jones. Goaltender covers it up, and we'll get a reset here. Centers are set. Face off, ready to resume play. Tampa Bay's got it, and they're on the attack. Oh, break out the ice packs. He lays out to block that shot. Ow! The Leafs carry it along the wall. A chance in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Made the stop on that play. Now the shooter's gonna run out of real estate because he does a great job of getting out of top of the crease and taking away all the room. When you make yourself as big as possible, there's less holes in the net. Toronto's won the draw. Through the neutral zone and along the boards, here they come. Moves the puck along the half wall. Shot gives them nothing in front. What an incredible save in a high danger scoring area. I mean, right in the slot, he's in perfect position to make that club save. The Leafs have had a lot of good looks offensively, but they still trail in the second. Toronto's won the face off. And some good footwork to kick it away. And sends it just out of reach. Benoit's lugging the puck. Passes on over to Tavares. Maintains control of the puck. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Isimont's been putting on a passing clinic tonight, James. Eyes in the back of his head and just distributing it to the right place at the right time. Receives the pass. 
Oh, and he slowed him up, and the officials right there all over it. And the officials will pass the sentence here. They got to put a pin in the penalty balloon here, James. The frustrating calls, no question about it. But they got to figure out a way to control their emotion and get back in this game. Shooting through traffic is an art, James. Not everyone can do it. You got to find a way to get the puck through. And when you have players that have the IQ and the shot, this is exactly what you do on your power play. You get it up high, and then you shoot the puck. But you need net front presence. You need hard, physical bodies in front to be able to collect the rebound and bury it. The Leafs gain possession. Moves it quickly over to Nylander. Taken along the wall by Glenn Denning. Here's a shot. Makes the save with the glove. What a save from point-blank range. I mean, he's in fabulous position. Square to the shooter in the slot. He makes the glove hand save. Sorelli's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. Absolutely fearless to step in front of that shot. Let's get the call. Being down by a bunch of goals, and then you get running around with frustration and out of control, and that's the reason why you took a penalty. Certainly that power play did. Yes, they didn't execute. It didn't seem to have the urgency that they had earlier in the game. And he takes the pass. Turns it away. Looks to make a play over to Benoit. Quick pass to McCabe. Takes the feed up ahead. Great vision to see that stretch pass. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Wrist shot from the slot. Toronto's had a lot of good looks offensively, but they have run into one hot goaltender, which is why they trail late in this second. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And he gets a piece of that one and denies it. Ice. 
Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Leafs win the draw. Puts it on net. Oh, big time blocker stopped by Vasilevsky. Can't hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Some solid defensive work in the road end with the poke check. And he takes the feed. Here's a short pass to Hedman. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Tavares. And he gets just enough of it to keep it out from the back of the net. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Here he is, wrists on net. You don't see that very often when you shoot it into your own net trying to clear the puck. That's ugly. The Leafs now need to find a way to get a few more of those. Yeah, they need them because if they get that pushback and they can get a couple more, they'll feel like they have an opportunity to win the game and then the sticks get heavy on the other side. But a lot of work to do to make that happen. Takes the feed. And that's stopped by the goaltender. Great save to stay with it. And they win the defensive zone faceoff. Getting a little physical out there, but still holds on to the puck. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Pervix. Picked up along the wall by Point. The Leafs gain control of it. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. Great defensive effort with the stick. Nice feed from the boards. Let's it rip. Oh, and he has the edge. Well, they needed something, and that clearly was something, Cheryl. Yeah, it certainly was, and there's some pushback, but they're going to need to layer it because they got to get closer than within two if they want to find a way back in this game. Well, this is an unlucky bounce, James. I mean, when you're a goaltender, you play your angles, you know your set positions, but you can't get set in a scramble like this, and it winds up in the back of the net. Toronto suddenly made a lot of people sit up here in these stands as they've made it a two-goal game now. Well, it's a game now, and everyone's standing because they know they're back in it. Just a two-goal deficit. One more, and they're within striking distance. The Bolts win possession here in the open ice. Takes it at center. Fires it. Makes the save. Jones really showing great rebound control, and what this does is it just cleans up the front of the net. Decides to go to the backhand. Made the save on the play. And the puck's kicked free. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Off the inside of the puck. Scores! Well, that's number two, Pounder. Yeah, he's been all over the puck tonight. He's feeling it. He's confident. You gotta believe he's gonna be looking for the Hattie. Well, he gets the shot off the most coveted area on the ice, right in front of the paint. Doesn't allow the goalie to get set up and puts it home. Tampa Bay's been feeling good all night long, and look at where we're at here. We're still in the late stages of the period here. Yeah, it's been an unbelievable game for them so far. I mean, they've just been so dominant offensively. Their opponent really doesn't know what to do. They're trying to slow the game down, but they can't because they're just on fire in terms of pace and dictating it. And he takes the feed. Takes it to the front. Oh, great hook save by the Tendee. The Bolts will play it from the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Broken up by McCabe. Tampa Bay's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Scooped up along the wall by Sorelli. Toronto gained possession along the boards. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Gets in front of it. Here comes the call. And that's the third call of the period, and it really looks like they weren't dialed in or ready to play in this game, and preparation is key, otherwise things like this happen. 
The Leafs send their man advantage unit out once more. Power play has scored today, but hasn't been excellent. This is where coaches make adjustments, whether you go with PP1 or PP2, or even if you intermix them. Tavares wins the faceoff in the offensive zone. Toronto's got a hold of the puck now. Tries to feed it over to Yarncho. And that's off target as it hits a body. Played big in the moment there. Jabs the puck away. The Bolts have it now. The Leafs going to work on offense. That's some smart heads up defensive play. But here's a breakaway. Oh, a beautiful save on the play. And you got to love these one-on-one -on -one battles. In particular, the goaltender so aggressive, tracks the puck and makes the save. Tears him up. Great save by Vasilevsky. Trying to get it out of danger. And that's off the glass and out. And there's one non-negotiable. If you're well, well, that's going to be a call, James. That's definitely a penalty. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. Well, we know the time on ice numbers are all going to the penalty killers here, James, because it has been an onset, a parade to the penalty box. They got to find a way to play even strength. The Leafs with a five on three, and they've got loads of time to work with here. Has dropped and we are back underway. Trying to clear and manages to clear the zone. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Yarncroc's got the puck in his own zone. Taken by Marner. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face off here on this power play. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Trying to clear, and they get the puck out, and they needed that. Uh, they certainly did. This PK unit has been on fire. They get the clear. That's one. You kill valuable time. That's two. And now three. You can contest the entry. That's a great play all the way around. Puck slid down the ice. Toronto's got possession of the puck. Matthews takes it along the wing. Takes a shot. And that'll bring an end to the second period of play. Let's get a clean sheet of ice and come back with the third period next. Fans, take a look to the sky. The home team Zeppelin is loaded with prizes. And in your way, all is are mission long. Time to drop the puck here in period number three. The Leafs' power play continues to start the frame, and they win the draw. Tampa Bay's got the puck against the half wall. And that one's turned aside. Pushes it across to Bertuzzi. Cuts to the paint, and that's tipped away from the net. You gotta have great hand-eye coordination to touch that puck, James. Does a great job of that. Just a little bit of a miscue as it misses the net. Dumps it in. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Here's a chance. Big time shot block there. Puck picked up by Riley. Too much congestion blocks the shot. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. Across the line and on the attack. Moves the puck. Unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at its finest. What an opportunity here on the power play with this offensive zone draw. It's all about motion and puck movement. Make the goaltenders already fatigued move. Toronto's won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. That's blocked by Vasilevsky. Puck is frozen and we'll get a face off. Tavares will look to win the draw to continue this power play. The Bolts win the draw here in their own end. Slides it diagonally to Sorelli. 
Chernak standing up, ready to go. The Bolts get back to even strength as the penalty-killing unit delivers. When you're feeling it, you're feeling it, James. And that's another effective PK. You don't get much better than that. And it's all about read and reacting. He did an excellent job. And somehow he hangs on. Oh, tremendous save of the play! What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Pogos got it along the boards. Poked away at center ice. Great stretch pass as he connects. Brilliant save. Read it perfectly. Picked up along the boards by Yarncro. Quick pass across to Domi. Knocks the puck loose. And now it's grabbed by Radish. The bolt slided through center. There's an injection of energy with that hit. Smart heads up play to neutralize the threat. Moves it quickly over to Lilgren. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Scores! Next! James, this is just an absolute clinic and body position how to roll off your coverage. And it's perfectly executed as he doesn't have much time to get the one-timer off, but he gets his stick available and he executes. The Leafs have to find a way to get a couple more here if they want to try to salvage this one. Taking calculated risks, James, and jumping into the attack and pressing upwards. Now, you may give up some opportunities the other way, but you got to go for it. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Let's it go! And makes the save. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Moves it over to Bertuzzi. The Leafs are on the attack. Here's a shot. Oh, that hits the cage. That's using your head. The Leafs have looked good tonight, but they still trail here early in this third period despite leading in the shot department. Off the draw that ties up his opponent. From the open ice, they gain the line. Shot. Oh, what a stop by Jones. The Leafs will play it in their own end. And that's picked off in the neutral zone by Mott. Toronto's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Tampa Bay's got the puck. Into the middle of the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Oh, gets a piece of it with the glove. Matthews has it along the boards. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. DeHaan stick handling in his own zone. He carries the puck up along the wing. Shot. Goodness, it stayed out. What a save. It was all but in, James. And that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. And as play continues, this place is still buzzing, and they're getting loud here now. Well, this is all about fan appreciation for that huge save. And, man, does this ever feel good. You know, you feel it right through you when you know you've made that big save. And everyone around you is appreciative. Vasilevsky's gonna wait for the whistle, and I don't mind this strategy here, Cheryl. Me neither. I mean, he's having himself a game, isn't he, James? He has been dominant between the pipes, and he knows he needs to pounce on this puck. He looks up at the game clock. They're winning. Not much time left in the third. They gotta figure out a way to play it safe. Toronto's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Denied by the defender. Nice block. Vasilevsky's got the puck, and he's going to hang on for a whistle. Well, there's only one reason that this game is tight, James. It's the guy between the crease. He elects to hold on to that one. He has been dynamite. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And they'll dump it in. The Leafs scoop it up along the boards. Take it along the wall by Reeves. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Shot attempt completely fails on that. Essimont's moving the puck through his own zone. On the attack along the boards. Back to the blue line. Let's it go! Here's a shot. Glove save. 
Toronto's had no shortage of offensive scoring chances, but they still trail here in this third period. The Bolts win that offensive zone faceoff. Quick feed to Hagel. Oh, and they'll be forced to start over from center as the puck leaves the zone. Nice feed from the right wing. Penalty coming up here. This is a frustrating situation, James. Just taking a whack load of penalties and really unable to get any momentum in this game because they're shorthanded the whole time. Toronto's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Although they've scored on the power play tonight, it hasn't been pretty. It's actually been quite ugly, James. But it's all about resetting and refocus because the time is now. Mercy to Bertuzzi. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. And yet another penalty is called, so out comes the PK unit. And you know what? They are taxed. They are worn down. If this continues, it's all going to backfire. Marner's aware his team is trailing in this one, guys. Let's look to him to try to get things going. His zone ability can definitely help him do that. Nylander's won the draw there on the attack. Sorelli's taking it from his own end. Puck clear from the defensive end. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Feeds the puck over to Marner. Stoppage in play, offside the call. Tavares is ready for the face-off as we are about to resume this power play. The Leafs win it. Puck grabbed by Riley. Stopped by the goaltender. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Glenn Dennings ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. The Leafs win it. Quick pass to Matthews. Good stop by Vasilevsky. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And they get the puck out of the zone. I like the aggressive sequence to this PK unit, James. They're all over the puck in straight lines. They're hard and heavy on it. When they get it, they send it 200 feet down the ice. And this kills some valuable time and gets them a line change. To the low slot. Lays into the body. Sends a pass over. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. The Leafs have it against the wall. Oh, big time save by Vasilevsky. Takes the feed. Off the glove. The Bolts move the puck in the defensive zone. And called for the offside. We'll get a face off. Nylander's team is trailing, and he's out there looking to make a difference for them, guys. One way he can do that is by using his zone ability to get things going offensively. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. The Lightning have possession shorthanded. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Toronto's got the puck in the defensive end. The Leafs have time for one last rush here on this power play. Moves it to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. They'll get set to drop the puck as this power play continues. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. Vasilevsky's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Mott's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Nylander's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. Hedman's hauled down. Penalty on the way. And here comes the judgment from the official. Marner's called for tripping. He's off to the box.
Tampa Bay's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Sometimes you're trying so hard, you do take a penalty, and that's a tough one to take. But they still have a huge opportunity here and a very threatening four on three. Here's a short pass to Riley. Here they come on the attack down the left side. The Leafs fail to capitalize on the power play. Tampa Bay's got a chance. Oh, save of the play! Whoa. He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. As a defender, you love when your goaltender has this kind of rebound control. Makes your life so much easier. And player hauled down to the ice. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up here. Well, you can see the coach looks skyward on that third call of the period. They know that they got to get back to even strength and get some kind of offense generating. A little four-on-four four coming up here. Not typically that we see four-on-four four action, although it's a lot of fun. You certainly know they practice it in practice. This is something that they're aware of. They know what they're doing. They want to possess the puck and try and create numerical advantage. Shot with the stop. Toronto's looking to break out. The Leafs cross the line and gain the zone. Too much traffic in the lane. Angles it over to Stamkos. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. The Leafs get a hold of the puck in their own end. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Puck scooped up by Hedman. Moves it quickly over to Stamkos. Puck picked up by Paul. Slip feed. Denied by Jones. He reads this play perfectly, James. He gets tight to the shooter. There's no room to put it by him. And that's poked away by Hedman. Tampa Bay's got it in their own zone. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Takes a shot. Oh, what a glove save there. He read that perfectly. The Leafs still trail in this third period despite numerous scoring opportunities. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Delayed penalty coming up here. Toronto's moving it along the wing. Quick feed to Lilgrim. Shot! Whistle blown, stopping the play. This is not the way they wanted the game to go. Just undisciplined, taking a ton of penalties. They'll have to reset and refocus if they want to find a way to get on top. The Leafs dig in on this four-on-three man advantage here. On a four-on-three, there's more ice available, but you have to continue with motion. Pull the coverage outside to open up those lanes. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. They score! And the power play strikes once again! Well, you know that specialty teams are so critical, James, and they have executed with the player advantage all night long. This is a great power play goal, James. They have the execution in terms of their passing along the outside, and then they attack the net with a shot. You have to have net front presence and create a screen. That's exactly what they have, and they capitalize as a result. The Leafs have suddenly put themselves into striking distance to even things up here in the third. And it's tough when you're on the other side of this. You can feel the wave coming, and you're not sure how to stop it. So they have to find a way to continue the pace and put them on their heels and just attack the net. Loves the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Stopped by the goaltender. Taken by DeHaan. And as the penalty expires, they'll go to work now on the man advantage. Moves it to point. Oh, what a save in front. Takes the puck. Takes a shot. Redirected off a stick. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. And he keeps possession. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. The Leafs take it across the line. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. And he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the paddle. And a successful clearing attempt. The Leafs have it now. Handles the pass. Textbook poke check by Kucherov. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. 
The Leafs gain possession. Tampa Bay's ready to go on the attack. And now it's grabbed by DeHaan. And that's knocked away by Yarncro. Quick pass to Domi. Takes the pass. Handles the puck at the point. Sends it to the middle. And that's intercepted. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. With possession along the wall. The Leafs get a hold of the puck along the boards. Nice zone entry from the left. Skates to the crease. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Comes up with the block. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Radish is almost ready to get back on the ice. And the stick, his best friend on that save right there. Tampa Bay's PK unit comes up clutch. Well, they're going to continue to trail here because they weren't able to get the equalizer on the power play. A missed opportunity, and really, timing is everything. So they'll have to figure out a way to dictate pace and get back on the board. Tony's won the face off, and now let's see what they can do. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. He's like a magician out there. The puck is on a string. He can maneuver around his opponent, and he gets net front and just can't execute because the goaltender is right there and makes a nice save. And look at this. They turn this offensive end into a pressure cooker. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. When you're the culprit and you're going to the box for the second time in one period, you recognize that you've also compromised your team here. It's a team sport. And, man, they're not happy right now. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. Well, a timely power play at this juncture of the game, James, to even it up. This is huge for this power play. Your big stars, they need to shine. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. Nylander's ready to take the draw here on this power play. Nice job tying up his opponent. Takes a shot. Oh, what a club save there. Glenn Denning's ready for the draws that will continue to try to kill off this penalty. And they win the draw on their own end. Here's an opportunity to get the puck out of their own end. Oh, and a nice job getting the puck out of the zone. Uh, first, you got to get it. So the PK unit does a great job reading. Where oh, I saved it. What a stop. Well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind them. He's going to be the foundation tonight. Works it across to Barner. The Leafs played along the boards. The boards grab possession to the puck. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Taken here by Mott. Moves it quickly over to Glenn Denning. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Strong defensive effort. Grabbed along the boards by Marner. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. The Lightning have gained control of the puck shorthanded. The Leafs gain control of the puck. Lilgren's going to play it against the half wall. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Sorelli's got on the offensive end. A chance in front. And that goes up. The score! And a shorty at that. Just love this goal, James. I mean, this is a PK. Not just a PK, but a power kill. They go and attack when they recognize the opportunity. And they create this chance, and they put it away. Tampa Bay's in the driver's seat now, up by two in this third period. Oh, yeah, and it's been a consistent effort from start to finish here, James. Now they got to make sure that they play this last little bit the same way they started. Aggressive on the puck, but be cautious when they need to. Sometimes the simple play is the effective one. Scores! And they strike once again with the extra attacker. Wow, this has been a potent power play. And two things you need. You need creativity, but you also 
also need structure, and the players know exactly where they need to be to set up to work their magic around the perimeter and then open up the lanes to attack the net. The Leafs dial up exactly what they needed. A goal here in the third. A lot of pushback right now at the latter half of the third period. And you know that the coach is going to make some adjustments. You want to have the opportunity to get your star gifted, creative, offensive players out there when you need to get an equalizer. Here's a shot. Turns him away. The Lightning have the puck in their own zone. Now he takes it over the line. Tampa Bay's got the puck behind the net. Hammers it on net. Answers the call with a big save. The Leafs have played well tonight, creating all sorts of scoring chances, but they still trail here in the third. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. And he takes the dish. Passes over to Marner. Handles the puck. From point blank. Nice save from point blank range. Takes the shot. Oh, they do it again. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. The setters will glide into the dot. The Bulls take possession off the faceoff. Here's a short pass to Stamkos. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Big hit, and that frees up possession. On the attack, they come down the right wing. Quick shot! Scores! They've tied it up here with a timely goal in the third. Now with their backs up against the wall, they decide to turn the tides and put on the press, if you will, James, and they get the equalizer. James, the credit always goes to the goal scorer, but how about this beautiful deke and gift of a pass? I mean, knowing how to draw the coverage to you, that is creativity at its finest. The Leafs' perseverance pays off as we are tied here in the back half of the third. Perseverance, you said it, just finding a way to get it done and stick with it. That's what they've done, and they found themselves here. They've got the equalizer now. It's a matter of now attacking and finding a way to get on top. Fires it on net. Love save made by Vasilevsky. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Carlton's got the answer as to who had the better night. Matthews was the more noticeable player, in my opinion, guys. Being able to generate chances is how he contributed to his team tonight. The Bolts start with the puck in their own end. Hedman's got it in the defensive end. Moves it around along the half wall. Puck is grabbed here inside the offensive end by Hagel. Picked up along the wall by Point. Hedman's a true sniper, James, and he's already got two in the game, and you know he's looking for his third. Feeds it down low. Slides the puck over. Receives the pass. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. Well, that's a tough call. He's part of the power kill. He provides offense when he's on the PK. You saw it with that shorty, and now he's sitting for two. Well, I really like them working off the 1-3-1 sequence that they were successful on earlier, James. It really opens up the ice, so you're using and stretching the entire zone. And listen, there's a lot of ice for the defense to cover. So you can look to the flanks, you can look to the bumper, but a lot of options off of it. Puck move back to the neutral zone. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. The Leafs have stayed the course this entire game, and it's a reason why they fought back to evens. Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Lilgren's lugging the puck. And now he passes up to Domi. Moves the puck into the D zone. Takes it and looks ahead. He grabs the puck here at the point. Oh, and he whiffs on it. Toronto's got control of the puck. Tampa Bay's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. They clear the zone. Along the half wall with the puck. 
good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. And they move the puck out of harm's way. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Oh, what a smart heads up play. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Tries to feed it over to Yarncroft. Up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. Here we go. They've really ratcheted up the intensity here now in the Ozone. Carries it. Oh, and another big time clutch stop. On the outside to Yarncroft. Well, your specialty team coaches are constantly telling you on a power play that you need to take advantage. And the way that you do that is to take away the eyes of the goaltender. A ton of net front presence here. And that's the reason the seeing eye shot finds its way to the back of the net. The Leafs have to be feeling good about themselves after taking the lead with that goal here in the third. Yeah, and it's not much of a cushion the way this game has gone back and forth, James, but it's something. You're in the lead, so now you want to continue with that tempo. Find a way to push your opponent back. Continue to punch and press. Toronto's got the puck here in the open ice. Hard hit frees up the puck. The Lightning have taken possession along the wall. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. Puts it on net. Incredible reflexes on the glove saved by Jones. The Leafs haven't stopped putting pucks on net, and they lead it here late in the third. Can they take advantage after winning that draw? Sacrifices the body to block that in front. Sends the pass over. Tampa Bay's got control of it now from their own end. And he takes the pass. Moves the pass in front. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. The Leafs looking against the half wall. Moves it to the middle. Oh, what a chance, and that goes off target. Here they come on the attack. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Tries to make that cross ice speed. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. Toronto's got possession here in the offensive zone. That knocks him off the puck. Slides it back to the blue line. Centering pass. Couldn't complete the pass. Hagel's gaining momentum. Quick feed for Kucherov. Oh, a clutch save! And he takes the feed. Passes it over to Matthews. The Leafs play it along the wing. Scores! Break out the clutch here on the Steelers because that's a four on answer. Well, it's incredible. You can tell that they are moving and shaking. They're getting the puck going north. They're transitioning so fast. And man, do they have their opponent on their heels. Man, that looked like a goal scorer's goal. Just a knack for the net, but it all comes off of a beautiful distribution. I mean, just eyes in the back of the head to be able to give that gift right to the stick. The Leafs lead it late in this third period. And off the draw at center, they take control of the puck. Puck grab by Nylander. Big time stop by Vasilevsky. A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender to task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Well, you're leading late in the game. You've got to find a way to kill the clock. You know what the best thing is to do? Make sure it's not in your zone. That takes the pressure off, and that's a smart dump right there. Sits it to the middle. Great defensive heads-up play to pick it off. Here they come on the rush. Here's a pass to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Good hit to bump him off the puck. 
The Leafs have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Toronto's got a hold of the puck. Fires it! Great three. Oh, spectacular save right there! Wow! Unbelievable. I mean, it was all but in, and he steals it because of that last-ditch attempt to find the puck. Oh, he stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. They just keep coming in waves here in the offensive end. And the base got him in the wrong end. Shot. He scores! And he completes the hat trick. Well, he's been zipping and buzzing along the ice this entire night, hasn't he, James? And man, do the fans appreciate him. Goal, Jane, with a lot of elements woven into it. I mean, he's stumbling, so he almost falls, but he's able to get a shot off just in time. He's able to hold himself up and get that shot off. His hands away from his body, not in the greatest position, but he manages to find the back of the net. The Leafs are sending a clear message that they are not taking their foot off the gas in this third period here, Cheryl. Well, you can certainly tell that they bought into the game plan, and the coach is certainly ecstatic with the performance of the entire bench. I mean, look at the way they're moving and holding the puck, attacking the net at the right times. It has been a seamless effort. Moves it to point. Can't get a hold of that pass. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. The Leafs have it from their own end. Lilgren's crossed the line and is on the attack now. Takes the feed. Break away. Makes the scores. Absolutely clinical finish on the breakaway. All the way down the ice, James. The ability to get away from the pack. Look over his shoulder, know where everyone is, and then that clean finish. Unbelievable goal. The Bolts haven't had a lot of things go their way tonight, but they finally got a positive here in the third. They're going to have to outnumber their opponent if they want to claw back from this two-goal deficit. They're running out of runway. they got to find a way to get some chances. Under a minute to go in the third. Point swooping in on the attack. Takes a shot. Oh, and he gets a piece of the puck to deny them there. Goaltender has made his way to the bench. The extra attackers out. They need a goal here big time. Right through center and into the offensive zone. Centering pass. What a chance, but they can't connect. Oh, what a save. Uh, that doesn't swing momentum in your favor. I don't know what will, James. That's a last-ditch effort. Storms into the empty net. Kevin, I feel like you must have had a few empty netters in your day. Oh, yeah. Fist pumping everywhere, even when it was the empty net. Well, that's a strong effort all the way around. Stingy defensively at the end of the game, and they're able to get that empty netter, and it's the dying minutes here, James. It should seal the deal. Toronto's offense has put on a show tonight, and here they are in blowout mode late in the third. Matthews wins the draw at center. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Great reach with the puck check. The Bolts have it now. And as the final seconds tick off the clock, the home fans acknowledging what they just saw tonight. Dished on over to Barner. It is all over. Well, Cheryl, as a defender, how do you explain this one? Not too sure here what the heck happened in between periods, James. They came out flat, no urgency, just got a little too comfortable. What a game, what an atmosphere, and they're not done just yet. Here they come back out onto the ice. Oh, listen to it in here. I mean, it's electric. They just love what they saw on the ice, and they're getting a salute, a thank you, which has gone down as tradition for this team to be able to say, hey, fans, you've been there all the way. Hope everyone had as much fun as we did here tonight. For all of us at EA Sports, I'm James Sabelski saying peace.